Hey YouTube family and welcome back. Uh, what we're going to do today guys, we're going to try these uh, beautiful lamb shanks from Aldi which I purchased. Now these take about, approximately about 9 minutes in the microwave they reckon. And that's about um, a thousand watt microwave. But what I'm going to do today guys, I'm going to do a little bit uh, of a different thing. I'm going to actually uh, nuke them in the microwave to get them a little bit warm and then I'm going to chuck them in the pan. And what I've got is I've got in the background some vegetables, I've got some mash ready. I'm going to serve that up the traditional Aussie way. And these are ready, uh, set, cook, nine minutes, uh, ready to heat, cooked lamb shanks, rosemary lamb shanks with a full bodied red wine and rosemary jus. All right, so let's take the packet out. So it says that's what they look like inside, guys. There's two of them. I've been dying to have lamb shanks. Hey, last time I had them, I think, is I remember when I had my restaurant about seven, eight years ago, or maybe longer. Oh no, sorry, longer. In 2007 it was, 2008. So what I've done is I could have cooked these myself, but I want to try different products and experiment to see how we go. All right, so what I'm going to do, guys, it says don't pierce these. Do not open or pierce the film. Heat or high for eight minutes, 30 seconds, self-venting film expands as it heats, forming a bubble as food is steamed. And then we're going to go chuck it in the pan. We're going to heat up the jus, everything, the mash, and the veggies, and we're going to serve it, all right? So I'm just going to whack down the microwave for about, uh, well, mine's a very strong, mine's about 1,500 watt. So I might whack that in there for about, say, five, six minutes, and we'll go through this procedure, and then we'll start chucking the pan and plating up. All right, wait me long, guys. All right, at this stage, guys, I've uh, put that on for about seven minutes, uh, which doesn't matter. I can fix that up. All right, now this has got expiry date of the 4th of the 4th, 2021. So it's got a bit of a long expiry date. Uh, heating instructions, we went through that. Do not open or pierce film. Heat at high for eight minutes, 30 seconds. Self-venting film expands. So the it expands and it heats forming a bubble as food is steamed when you stand it for one minute peel back the film take care as hot steam will escape appliance very considerably please adjust us heading times if necessary all right now this is made in australia from at least 81 percent australian ingredients i'll show you there in the back down the bottom there guys all right good source of protein Wog Dad needs protein because like in my previous video, like I said, I'm going to start training guys. I'm going to get my body back in shape. Wog Dad's been putting a lot of weight. Uh, you, you can all see my big gut. That's why I'm hiding it today with the apron. But soon you'll see my transformation. Give me three, four months, six months, whatever, and I'll get back on track. Anyway, it's gluten free. Storage instructions. Uh, keep refrigerated. Store below four degrees. I'm just going to put this pan on as we speak and the other one as well. All right, and whoa, I can smell that through the microwave already, that red wine, everything. All right, so red, it's got a lamb shank, 75% red wine, rosemary, jus, 25% water, juice powder, sugar, uh, malted extra and thickener, salt, flavors, vegetable powders, potato starch, colors, vegetable gums, uh, powder contains thickener, natural flavors, natural colors, vegetable gums, herbs, celery, carrot, leek, rosemary, red wine, and rosemary, jus, contains 7% red wine. 0.1% of rosemary. Contains milk and sulfites, may contain fish, sesame seeds, nuts, blah, blah, crustaceans, because these guys make multiple uh, different stuff. And uh, nutrition information, energy is 1,600 kilojoules per serve, 38.5 milligrams of energy. Oh my, that smells so good. I just want to eat it without even bloody sticking in the pan. Yeah, so it's uh, got tray, sleeve, film, uh, and yeah, from Aldi, guys. And this, for two of these, cost me $13 for a pack. And that's a bargain. I reckon it's a bargain. All right, let's put that aside. I'm just going to check the microwave, guys. It won't be long. It looks pretty good. It's nearly ready. I'm just going to turn my pan on. My pan's heating up for the shanks. Because what I want to do... Is once I heat the shanks up in the pan, I'm going to add the juice and get the jus happening and uh, get a little bit more thicker with a bit more with uh, some butter and stuff. What I've done, guys, I've got some broccoli, some cauliflower, and some peas, which I prepared before. So it's up front, it's ready. So we're going to deal with it. And I've got my mash, which has got some butter, salt, 
uh, parsley, and uh, some olive oil. So we're gonna serve that up with that. Today what we're doing guys, we're using the Romana extra virgin olive oil like usually from uh, Audi. I know I've been standing away from Woolworths a little bit because uh, I've been finding a few different products at Audi for some reason, but I love Woolworths too. It's my favorite store. We're using the famous sex of salt like usual. Got have salt. And I've got my Western Star butter guys. All right, so what I'm gonna do because the pan's nearly heated up. Alright, I'm going to turn that down just a touch because I don't want to spurt in my face. I'll turn the vegetables on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to chuck a little bit of butter in the uh, vegetables. Just want that beautiful flavour through it. Oh, drop some butter. Oh, dropped it again. Alright, I'm going to add a little bit of salt into the veggies. I know it looks like a lot on the camera but it's actually not that much. Right, some olive oil. Alright, so I'm just gonna go pull these out of the microwave, guys. I won't. Oh, and I'm also having some oh, white wine tonight because uh, finally I've got some time off to myself. I've been dealing with a lot. As you know, my son hasn't been well, so I've dropped him off, and the, uh, the other half has had an operation, so things have been a bit tough. I couldn't go to work last night, as you all know, but uh, it's all looking good. All the best and also I've got some natural mint right in the garden I plant some veggies thank you to a friend that has helped me out and give me some veggies it's gonna give that a bit of a, a flip oh we lost our pee I peed everywhere again all right so our veggies are heating up just gonna check it guys won't be long Wait me long guys, I'm just trying to grab this, this is extremely hot. I just don't want to burn myself. There you go guys. That's really like hot, so be careful, make sure you use a rag. Don't burn your hands. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pierce or peel, actually I'll peel it back. When you peel it back be careful, because that's extremely hot. You don't want to burn your skin. Oh my god, that smells so good. It looks so good. Sorry, very hot. I'm going to try and peel it back. <sighs> very hot, guys. you got to be really careful. Trust me, this is hot. I'm going to use half the time. All right, I got it back halfway. What I'm going to do is the oil's heated up. Is I'm going to get a shank. All right? This is our first shank. See that beautiful sizzle? That's going crazy. Oh my god. I need a second one out. Second one. Usually I only supposed to stick this in the microwave, uh, but like I said, I'm doing it in the pan as well. Sorry about the oil everywhere, it's just gone crazy. So I've turned the veggies off. Veggies guys ready. Mash is ready. White wine to complement. And we've got our uh, shanks, which we're just going to flip over a little bit, a couple of times. All right, and then we're going to add our sauce, our red wine jus with vegetables. And then we're ready to play that, guys, and we're done. All right, we'll turn that one off. So that's sizzling now. I'm going to add the sauce. Whoa, that is very hot, guys. Be really careful. It will literally burn your hand. Right, I'm just going to wipe my hands and now what I'm going to do guys is I'm just going to add a bit more butter to the veggies. It's good to have butter. I'm going to add a little bit of butter to the pan. 
to this one. Not that it needs thickening up, but I reckon it'll be good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add a touch of salt. I haven't even tasted it. We're going to add a little bit more olive oil to that one and a bit to that one. We get the butter put aside. And thank you very much, guys. Yes, I know I look really handsome in my shirt and my apron. You know why? Wog Dad's got a lot of positive energy, guys. He's been going through a lot, and you know what? He's a master now. He's uh, the champion, and Wog Dad's here strong for you guys. And I won't stop. All right. I don't know if the wine's gotten to me. I'm talking too much. Maybe I'm over self confident, guys. Like Superman. Alright, so. That looks absolutely amazing. Oh my god. Alright, let's get that red wine jus. Everything's off. I'm just going to bring this one closer, guys, so you can see it. So it's flat all over the wall. But look at those beautiful shanks. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. All right, I'm gonna turn it off because that's ready. It's ready. It didn't take that long. All right, how long have we been in the video? Eleven minutes. Didn't take that long. Just let that boil a little bit more. The veggies are done. I'll give that a little bit more of a stir. I'm gonna plate up now, guys. Should I have a taste test? I reckon I should. Because if I don't, we won't know what it tastes like, and then maybe you guys won't buy it. All right, so. Put everything aside. Shanks are still boiling. Alright. Cheers guys. One more sip for you. All the best. And I I um I, I hope everyone has a beautiful future full of luck, prosperity, a lot of love, a lot of money comes in your pocket, guys. And I'm giving my positive energy to you. And I know it's all gonna work out. Alright, cheers, bye. Oh, not bye, sorry. But I had one sip and I'm saying bye already. Well, that's not crazy, bro. All right, guys, don't worry. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna get some veggies. All right, we're gonna plate up our plate. Hope everyone enjoyed my snapper last night. Oh my God, I actually ate all of that plate, guys. I ate all of it. That was absolutely sensational. I haven't had snap in a long time. That was so good. Oh my god, I recommend it and I'll do it again. All right, now we got that on, guys. So, next, bit of mesh. All right, now I've done two because one's for my, for my son, my big boy, Taka. All right, so I've got my mesh. That's what it looks like so far. All right, vegetables and mesh. Now, next, we're going to grab a shank. Right, let's get a little bit of a mix. Oh my god. You can't tell me that that, that bloody doesn't look good. Oh my god. All right, a bit of sauce, jus, red wine jus. Pour that over. Don't let it all over the veggies yet, because we want to take a photo. And that's got to look good. Oh. Oh my god. That is absolutely superb. Now we've got our mint guys. A bit of a garnish. Just gonna put that there on the side. That's from our garden. Wow. This is nah, this is amazing. This is absolutely astounding. Look at this guys. Look at that. Beautiful shank <gasps> with the red wine jus and the veggies and the mash. Oh my god! Absolutely beautiful. Does anyone want to marry me? If you want to marry me, guys, comment. Look at this. I could feed you, I could feed my queen. With this. Look at that. 
Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna get a little bit closer. Sorry I'm getting carried away with this, but this is absolutely gorgeous. This is this is like sensational guys. This is oh I'm sorry, I don't know what else to say, but look at that. Look at the beautiful steam, the heat. Oh. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave that one on the plate. I'm not gonna destroy that because I wanna take photos, I'm gonna put it aside. I'm gonna have a bit of a taste test. From this one on the side. Alright. Let me get a little plate. Let me get a little plate. Wait a minute. Alright. So I'm gonna put a little bit of mash. I'm gonna put some veggies. A little bit of cauliflower, a little bit of this and that. Alright, now, got a little bit of lamb. I'm going to leave my thing for sauce. Because we're going to taste that sauce. There we go, guys. Look at that. That's our lamb. Look at that beautiful steam in that beautiful red wine jus. Let's have a bit of a taste there, say. Mm. Oh my goodness, that lamb is very tasty, it's superb, and it's it's like not even chewy. It's like so soft and tender, when you put it in your mouth, it melts in your mouth and goes straight down. Alright, now, bit of veggies with the sauce, broccolini. Mash. A bit more. Sorry, I had to approve that. You know what? I approve it. It is better than 10 out of 10. And the way I did it, probably ended up better. So make sure when you purchase this product at Aldi, guys, do it the way I did it. If you just microwave that, maybe it's just going to be like, you know, micro food. But adding in the pan, getting that extra crispiness on the outside of the uh, shanks, and heating that sauce up a little bit extra in the pan with some butter, and serving with mash and some vegetables. The best, man. Just like you guys. The best. Alright guys, cheers, thank you very much for watching, don't forget to share, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell for further notifications and uh, wish the best uh, to everyone out there and uh, don't feel like you're alone guys, if you have any problems or you're stressed, make sure you talk to a friend and um, try and get through it guys, don't let things get to you, remember, if you stay positive, positive things come to you, if you stay negative, negative will follow you. Doesn't matter what we go through, stick together, all right? And if you feel stressed, watch my videos so you can feel positive. And I love you guys. Take care. Bye.